and this in the competencies uh, some competencies on the future of education 2030 we are going to involve the stakeholder just like parents teachers communities and peers to work together to support the future of education in, in Indonesia and of course uh, And as also we have also uh, the challenges of human resources of development in the era of one uh, This is about the, the the description of our country that more than uh, 84 percent job uh, position over the world will be replaced by certificated machine. And also we have to prepare the human resources for supporting this this uh, condition. And also this is the milestone of Indonesian China cooperation. For the vocational education and the top priority, especially it has focused on the system of the education for the uh, higher vocational, the junior college, and also the secondary. So that is uh, the integration vertically and also horizontally. It is more like the overpass. So it's a never one way street. We believe that if you just have some degrees alone, it's not going to be enough. We still need to look at the You know, the general education, the lifelong education, non-degree education, we want to have the overpass that's moving smoothly and that is going to be the top priority in the challenges. I think that for the future, that for the education technology has set the higher requirements. And I, we need to understand what is the Web 2.0 and also the basic concept, the interface and dialogue between human beings and machines is not only about the knowledge. So that means for the technology, we need to have a better understanding. The technology is not itself, it's not 1.1 plus 2, the technology is um, more about the integration of the possible technology and the social desire as well as the expectations. So if we want to meet this our cultural background, value proposition, laws and regulations, so the technology involvement shall consider all of that. That means so this topic is closely relevant with the economic growth, so it will always follow the dynamic of the economy. And for the schools, as we're the main players uh, here for the running of the school, we should adjust the majors, the curriculum, resources to support the local needs of the economic growth. The teachers should also follow through the new business types and skills, upgrade the contents of teaching. We also should make our research available. And also we need to grow together with those who are at this age of learning and those who are not. And we need to know what are the patterns and roles, how do we change and improve efficiency of curriculum, improve the sustainability of students and the development of career. We also facilitated the learners to have a good job and in good industries. So the next is really important. The adaptability is really about the scientific spirit. And we need to understand what we do need before decision making. We should also enrich the cultures of the vocational education. We do have the diverse culture in itself as well. And also the thing is also we should take the history as the reference and usher in the new future because we're the beneficiaries and our service providers as well. For the business, they don't feel very secure because they worry the graduates will move back, go to the other provinces. So that's why we have done this integration of the platforms. So that's why I think that if we really want to make it work, I think that for the five-year occupational school, I'm very confident in our model. So that means that we need more excellent talent to really have the ambition to be the craftsman of a great country and the workers of the industries and to really study here in the vacational educational system so that we will be able to have a starting point, a pillar, and also the focus before we will be able to follow through the new requirements so that we can really pull it off and then communicate, implement the policies of quality, the spring 
to the realities. Partnerships between the vocational education and the industry. If we cannot address this issue, then what would be the values, what would be the approach of the vocational education would not matter that much. The vocational education is born with the, the responsibility to provide the career development opportunities for all social members. That's the mission of vocational education with that background. We have to facilitate another partnership, which is the one that vocational education needs to really contribute to the partnerships between the vocational education and industry.